Hi everyone, I'm Stephanie and welcome back to my channel! I don't know what, what it is, it was weird, but it's okay. I'm weird. So today's video is gonna be about my favorite nude lipstick, so liquid lipstick, gloss, pencil and regular lipstick. But before I jump into the video, both of my kids are with me right now because I'm filming in my uh, living room, so the playroom is just right in front of me, so they are both with me, so it's gonna be a little bit loud around me, <laughs> sorry. But it's okay, it's my life, I'm a mom, and yeah, it is what it is. Before you to jump into the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to follow me on my social media. So, without further ado, let's jump into this! Oh, before to jump also uh, into my favorite nude, right now I play with my Jaclyn Hill Volume 2 uh, palettes, but with the more... Um, like regular shade I want to say and they work so 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 great like our first palette. <laughs> so I'm gonna start with the pencil liners. So I love to use pencil even if I do a nude lips just because I love to put some dimension around my lips. So I'm gonna show you some few options. So I had some drugstore version and some more eye hand version. So the two first are from the same brand and they are from Essence. I really really love their uh, lip pencil. They glide so well on the lips. They are super, super cheap. Like, I think it's like two or three bucks each. So it's super, super cheap. And they are, I prefer my lipstick to be a wood pencil because I love to sharpen up like super, super with sharp. And the shade that I love is, the first one is Satay Mauve. So I love this one because when I want to put a more pinkish nude, so a more, a more cool tone look a little bit, I love to use this pencil. So this is the first uh, lip pencil. So it's a little bit more on the cooler side, but not too much. It has a little bit of a warm in it. So this is the uh, reason why I love, love, love this pencil. The second shade is in the nude. So this is a very, very nude pencil. So I don't know if it's gonna be good on more darker skin tone than me, because you're gonna see it's... A super warm pencil but pretty much super super nude but I love this one uh, when I want to have like a almost concealer uh, lips <laughs> so yeah I freaking love this too the other one is a new addition in my collection so it's the Morphe backseat love and I love this pencil again it's a wood pencil so my favorite one and it's what I had right now on my lips so it's look a little bit like the Essence one, but a little bit more on the warmer side, I'm gonna say, a little bit more uh, peachy. So I love, love, love this one again, one of my favorite, and they glide so well on the lip. The other two are from MAC Cosmetics, so the first one is Oak. So I buy this one because of all YouTubers on YouTube talk about it. Again, it's a wood pencil, my favorite. And this one is... A little bit more um, uh, neutral I would say so I love this one because it looks like a shadow on your lips so if you are on the like overlining kind of journey like me this is gonna look like a shadow on your lips so the last one is Whirl from MAC and this one is a little bit more pinky so it looks like a little bit like the satin mauve kind of shade but a little bit less warmer so I love, love this shade. It's not like the lipstick at all. I'm gonna uh, show you world lipstick uh, later on this video and it's not looking like the same at all. When it comes with uh, nude lips, I love to put some lipstick on be because I don't mind if I had to reapply during the day. It's not like a red lipstick and if... Thank you! And if I uh, transfer a little bit, it's not that bad because it's nude lipsticks. So I'm gonna show you all the lipstick that I love. So the first one is World from MAC. So this is a more darker uh, nude, I'm gonna say for uh, me at least. So where I'm gonna swatch this? So like this, I don't know if you can see. So it's more like a dark 
darker uh, warm tone lipstick but on my more uh, darker skin tone this would be so good on you and I don't want to put lipstick on my shirt and this is a matte formula but not a retro matte formula so it's like the comfortable matte formula my other lipstick is a new addition on uh, my uh, nude lipstick and this is the Morphe uh, Yfe matte lipstick so it's what I have right now on my lips so it's like a peachy kind of look and on me it looks like my uh, lip shade a lot so I love love this formula so it's so so lightweight on my lips I need more of a the matte formula in this Morphe range. It's just so comfortable and it doesn't emphasize all the dryness on the lips. Right now my lips are crusty. They are looking bad and it doesn't like look like this with the lipstick on. It looks like I had pretty much super hydrated lips but it's not the case. So I love 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 this formula and if you uh, take the lip kit it's super super cheap also. So. Yeah. So my favorite, favorite, favorite lipstick of all time, nude lipstick, it's Nude Lost from Maybelline. So this is a super, super nude and it's more on the, I don't want to say cool or side, it's more like neutral I would say. So it looks like this shade, I'm so bad swatching stuff, but I love, 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 love this one. It's just so beautiful every time I put this on my lips. Sometimes I, I had super, 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 super dry lips, crusty, ugly, disgusting lips. And this save just all uh, my lips all the time. So now liquid lipsticks. So liquid lipstick, I love to put them on my lips and apply a gloss after when I'm on a nude lips. Just because, just because. <laughs> I don't know why, but I love it. So the first one, so I don't have any uh, drugstore version liquid lipsticks, sorry, it's only ions, but I had some that is not too expensive, I would say. So the first one is a Sephora uh, lipstick and it's in the shade 13, so I, I don't know if it's Marvelous Mall, I think. No, I don't know, I'm not sure. Yeah. So this is a very cool tone liquid lipstick, so I'm gonna apply this right here. So it's a pretty much super cool tone, so if you're not into cool tone liquid lipstick, don't go with this one. But I love to have both, like super warm tone and super cool tone, because it depends on what I'm gonna do on my eyes. So right now it's pretty warm, so I need a warm tone lipstick. So uh, if you are here since the beginning, you know that I love uh, the uh, Sephora liquid lipstick, they are not too drying. It's a liquid lipstick, they are gonna be a little bit drying, but not as bad as other um, brand. And they are pretty much super comfortable on the lips. I, yeah, I love the scents, they are not super expensive. And they had like pretty much all the shade you can think. So yeah, I love the, uh, the range from Sephora. The other one, uh, of, well, this is my favorite liquid lipstick. These are uh, the Makeup Forever one, so this is in the shade 101 and I need more of the make, uh, Makeup Forever uh, range because they are pretty much super comfortable on the lips. So this is a pretty warm shade but not too much. It's, it's a neutral I would say. It's right in the middle and yeah I love this shade so much. This is one of the most uh, liquid lipstick, new liquid lipstick I would put on my lips, so the Makeup Forever one, I freaking love it. Another one that I love so 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 much is a Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Sellout. So this is pretty much super super warm. So this is a little bit more darker uh, than the other shade. So I love to mix this one with a more uh, lighter shade in the center. So I put this all around my lips and I'm gonna put a little bit of the makeup for everyone a little bit in the center of my lips, sorry. I'm back. So this one, they are not super super drying and they are not transfer proof like the Sephora and the makeup for everyone or... So, Next is the Stila Bassi liquid lipstick. So these are the OGs. 
I think they this uh, this and the Anastasia Beverly Hills one were the first liquid lipstick on the market. I'm not sure, but I think. So I love, love, love this one. I put this on my lips, I think, in my two last video. So this is a very cool tone, uh, pinkish lipstick. But I love this when I play with pink and everything on my uh, lids. These again are pretty much super transfer proof. They are super matte, but pretty much comfortable on the lips. And the last one is an OG again, is Anastasia Beverly Hills in the shade Pure Hollywood. So these are drying, but, and they are super liquidy too. So this one is pretty light. So this one, I love to put uh, this one on the center of my lips so to put a little bit of dimension around my lip. So these are my, fa uh, my five favorite shade for a liquid lipstick. So now we're going with the gloss. So the first one is again a new addition. So this is the Morphe Pop uh, Gloss. So it came with the lip kit. So this is a pretty much a peach uh, lipstick, not lipstick, gloss. Sorry, it's so loud around me. So it's a pretty much a peach. Oh, I just put my ends into lipstick. So this is a peach uh, gloss that I love because it's pigmented but not too much. So if you put this uh, over your lips, you're not gonna hide the color under it, but it's not like you didn't put anything too. So I love, love, love this. And it's glossy, glossy, but not sticky also. <laughs> And see it it's beautiful so the next one is a super expensive gloss I know it but it's a beautiful gloss so this is a Marc Jacob in the shade sugar sugar so this one is super super light so it's not gonna be good on everyone so this is a light milkyish gloss and I love to put this in the center of my lips and it's just putting so much dimension around them. Sorry, it's so loud. I know they are just keeping fighting every time. The other shade is a classic. So it's Buxom Right Russian. They smell so good. These are um, a little bit um, mentally on the lips. So it's gonna tingly a little bit. So these in winter, I don't love them when I need to go outside because it hurts a little bit the lips because it's cold outside. So yeah, so this is even more uh, yeah. paler than uh, sugar sugar lipstick, but it's more on the cooler side. So it's more like a pinkish uh, gloss, but I freaking love this one. The Buxom uh, gloss are just perfect. They are so beautiful they are super glossy it's tingling a little bit right now on my arm so it's weird but yeah i'm gonna add so much stuff on my lips it's gonna be crazy the two last one are from the same brand and you're gonna be shocked when i'm gonna mention it it's two fenty uh, beauty gloss they are just on all the gloss that i show you these are my favorite formula for gloss. They are super glossy, glossy, like it just look like you had lip injection, but they are not too sticky on the lips. So these are my uh, two favorite shades in, in the nude color. So the original one, so I don't know, Fenty Gloss, I think it's called. And this one is Sweet Mouth. I love the big fat one on it. So I'm gonna swatch both of them like it's so cool because this is in my air so this one is a little bit more darker and super warm it's show a little bit of color but it's it it adds just the perfect color in it so it's a little bit translucent but a little bit of color in it it's they are perfect so it's gonna look like nothing on my arms because it's not so 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 uh it doesn't have so much color in it but uh my lips just became so much juicier than what it was so if you want a glossy gloss juicy thing on your lips go with the fenty one they are they are the perfect gloss on the market right now 
So that's it guys for all my favorite nudes. So I'm gonna remove this on my arms because I'm gonna put this all around my shirt and it's uh, like it's something that I don't have any on my shirt right now. So I don't have anything else to say besides I love you guys and I hope you like this video. If you want a favorite kind of stuff just leave me that down below and I will do that for you. So I don't have anything else to say besides I love you guys and sorry for all the craziness around me during this video. <laughs> and yeah, I will see you soon, bye!